Welcome to week three, week three picks for you. Hope all is well. This is Smart Chat. Thank you for watching, like, and subscribing to my channel. If you haven't done so, please do so right now. And if you're keeping track, week two, I was three and zero. Oh. Week one, I was two and one. Therefore, I am five and one with my picks. Did you uh? Did you follow my uh, suggestions, my picks last week? Maybe pick that in your knockout poll. You're welcome. But anyway, week three picks and three for three. We're gonna, <coughs> yeah. Excuse me. We're gonna make three picks this week. Um, and week three usually is the week where the good teams kind of start being uh, going into a panic. Um, you know, they go into a panic. They want to show that they're really a good team. And, uh, you know, the first two weeks were a fluke. They say if you're 0-3, you have a very hard time making the playoffs. It's, you know, so, that being said, a lot of interesting games this week. I'm going to give you three games for my picks. And, obviously, this is just for entertainment purposes only. Not betting against the spread, nothing like nothing like that. Just simple win lose. First game, you have the Bears at Seattle. Bears, wrong place, wrong time. They don't have Jake Cutler. Some of you guys might think, well, that's a good thing. Not me, personally. I uh, I like Jake Cutler. They're going against the Seattle Seahawks, visiting the Seattle Seahawks. Seahawks are 0-2. They're a good team that's had a rough two games. You have Cam Chancellor now back on the team. You have the drama with uh, Sherman and his uh, mom who... Criticizing the offensive coordinator. You have the 12th man in Seattle. A team that's desperate. And with desperate, I think this team is going to come together. They're going to hold hands. They're going to show uh, that 0-2 is a fluke. You know, with uh, you know, the Bears, they're an awful team. They don't have their quarterback. Uh, it's, this is obviously a, a step back. Uh, this year for this team. The Bears aren't going nowhere. Give me Seattle to win this one. Next game. Another, and the theme of this week is desperateness. You have um, the uh, the Texans going against Jameis Winston, uh, Winston and the Bucks. The Bucks having to play at Texas. Texans have been on hard knocks this past summer. Right now, they're having a few hard knocks. They have a good defense. The defensive coordinator is one of the best, one of the gurus. That defense is good. Jameis Winston is going to do some good things. He's going to be a good quarterback. going to do some good things. However, it's tough going from Tampa... Uh, you know, going to, to Texas and winning there. Look for the Texans to win. I know Texas changed their quarterbacks, but I still think the defense is going to shine for the Texans. Maybe uh, I think uh, against that defense from the Bucks, you can see the Texas offense do something. And please do. I have Hopkins on my fantasy football team. So, give me the Texans. Third game uh, that we're looking at, we're looking at the Lions over the Broncos. Uh, no, not much really analysis that I could give you. I just really like the uh, the Lions to win this one over the Broncos. So, my picks for this three weeks. Seahawks, which is an easy one, I think. Texans, Lions. Hope all is well. Enjoy Football Sunday. Until next time, adios over and out.